The two Kansas women who fell victim to an elaborate murder plot in Oklahoma weren't meant to be found for decades, if ever. That's according to the court documents filed by investigators. They say Tad Cullum, boyfriend of Grandma Tiffany Adams, buried the women's bodies in a 10-foot hole in a pasture that he was renting from a man named Michael Beasley. Uh, two days before the women disappeared, Tad allegedly asked his landlord if he could use a skid steer to remove a stump and bury some concrete and do some dirt work on the land near a dam. And the landowner said, yeah, sure, that's fine. But the day after the women disappeared, Tad allegedly told the landlord, now there might be a problem. Uh, he said the police were looking at him, Tad, as a possible suspect, and that the skid steer might, you know, the tracks might look suspicious, to which the landlord responded that if anyone asked, he would say what he knew, that Tad had been out doing some work, dirt work. News Nation's senior national correspondent, Brian Enton, got exclusive access to the property. And there was dirt work, all right. A massive 10-foot grave had been dug and filled back in within hours. Here is what Brian saw on the night that he went out. It's dark out here, so bear with me, uh, but this is the area where the missing women were found. This is the spot. You remember in the police report, they mentioned uh, a dam. This right here, this, this buildup of dirt, this is the dam. There's a pond on the other side. Uh, and if you walk with me this way, uh, just about 50 feet or so, maybe a little more from the dam, you can see where the earth is disturbed, where the tractors were out here. This is where investigators came. They dug right in this area, went down about 10 feet, I'm told. Uh, and this is where they discovered the missing mom's bodies. If you look in the distance there, uh, you can see there is a pile of hay back there. I am told by sources uh, that that hay was moved over the area where the digging happened, that Tad, the suspect Tad, moved that hay over here uh, to cover up the area where he was digging, hoping that the cows, this is a, you know, there's a cow farm here, that the cows would come over, this is a ranch, and start feeding on the hay and make the area look less suspicious. Uh, but still, investigators were led to this spot. And again, this is the area right here where they started digging and they found the bodies. Just incredible work by, by Brian Anton. I should, uh, I misspoke. It was not Michael Beasley. The landowner's Jamie Beasley. And again, he leased the land to Tad Cullum. And Tad Cullum asked the landlord, mind if I just do some dirt work down there? Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.